Hey everyone, Technoment here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to force restart your iPhone 10. So let's get started. Usually this is something you want to do if you're having any software related issue, whether the screen isn't responding, it's glitching or bugging. It's Apple's number one troubleshooting step. So I'll show you how to do this. Now this does require a sequence of steps that you have to follow. First thing is you're going to locate the volume up, and the volume down button, which are right behind the ringer switch, and then this big side button. So what you need to do is quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button just like that in that sequence. So as you can see here, I'm holding down with that finger, that big side button until the screen goes completely black. Once the Apple logo reappears on the screen, I will let go of that side button. So we're waiting for that, and then I let go. Again, all I did was quickly press and release the volume up, volume down one after another, before holding on to the side button. And basically this shuts down the phone software, reloads the code. So if it was a software related issue, it's gonna go ahead and fix that. This is something you wanna do anytime you're having any issues with your iPhone. This is safe, it will not delete any of your data. So all of your photos, videos, apps, everything will be fine on your iPhone. So go ahead and give it a try. Now if it doesn't work the very first time, just keep on trying it, especially if it's your very first time. It does take a few tries to get hang of it. So again, volume up, volume down, and then you want to hold down that side button just like that one more time. We're going to wait here again for it to go completely black before we let go of that side button again one more time just to show you how that's done. I'm just doing that and then I let go. Again, very safe and easy to do. We'll fix most software related issues on your iPhone. That's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.